Hey everyone, welcome to West Coast Muscle Saws. I'm shooting this video from my studio here in the Pacific Northwest at the Cedar Creek Cabin. Some of my vintage chainsaws. And you've seen this before probably, it's my workbench here. There's a vintage chainsaw there. It's got that old car engine in it, West Bend. And some of the certificates and stuff that I've earned over the years. That bar is kind of unique. That was one of the first bars to come off the Virginia Beach factory signed by Mr. Hans Peter Steele himself. And I thought that was pretty awesome. And some very vintage saw chain. Some of the signage. Old cans of uh, McCullough mix oil, full of oil. And some home light. More vintage saws. Here's that picture of one of my customers right there, and she's running that saw right there. I can't remember, I think it was in the 50s, I think, when she was running it, she told me. She's not with us anymore, but boy, she was a great lady. Super Pro 125, Super Pro 81 there. <clears throat> what I really want to talk about today, though, is I have one of my customers. He's a collector of McCullough chainsaws. And you know the old saying, you know, I'll never buy another chainsaw. <laughs> well, he's selling his, and, uh, oh yeah, there's an old, old ball sitting there on the desk. Oh yeah, check this chain out. This is pretty awesome. Half a roll of that chain. Anyway, he's selling his collection. He's got a couple of health issues. He's doing good now, but he wants to, he wants to uh, let somebody else that would appreciate these. These are, uh, these saws are not really for people to go out and cut firewood with. They're worth way too much money and value uh, to be out there cutting wood with. It'd be great for uh, your collection or for firing up occasionally. I've worked on these saws over the years, kept them in shape for him. And of course, oh yeah, there's a picture of a lady running that chainsaw. Anyways, what, here's what he's got. We'll just do a run through here. Pretty rare saw there, you just don't see those. I remember when those came out, I was working in a McCullough shop and uh, you just didn't see them. I mean, super rare. Super Pro 105. And this one's in good shape. Of course, these are uh, in a collection. You'll, uh, you know, have to clean them up a little bit uh, and just be very careful with them. These saws are worth way more as a, for a collection than they are for uh, uh, timber cutting or firewood. Super Pro 125 there. And I'll be getting more pictures of his collection, but I just wanted to get this on there to help him out. And I'm going to give you his email address, plus his phone number here at the end of the video here. And you'll be able to contact Jeff and uh, he'll mail these to you. Ship them, box them, ship them up good. He's on the West Coast. Aren't those beautiful? There's the information you need right there. 661-599-3684 and just tell him that the chainsaw guy you've seen this on his video and uh, you uh, would like some information on those saws and there's his email address do a quick run through again just for the guys that want to stop this video and, and uh, examine these a little more Really great shape. Okay, there you guys go. Uh, you know how to get a hold of chainsaw guy, but Jeff's who you want to get a hold on, uh, get a hold of for this uh, information on these saws, and if you'd like to try to get your hands on one, one of these. Uh, Give them a shout. Good luck, guys.